retailers are doing these offers now. Yes. You know, we, Real to, deals. Yeah, and I don't pay much notice to them normally, but I have to say, we've picked out three here, just because I think they're quite interesting to talk about. So these are Valentine's specials? I they think. are. Yeah. Well, I think they do them all year, but right. specifically they've because they aimed at Valentine. Okay. Yeah. So what we got? Let's start here. Marks and Spencer at the front here. Look, this is 20 quid in for two. Starter, main course, sides, dessert, and a bottle of wine. And you also get a box of chocolates there. I quite like this because it's salmon, prawn, and scallop shells. Mark the front they there. Look, now, they look impressive, don't yeah, they? Yeah, you bake them in the gosh. oven. Although they're rather small. Well, that's fair enough. Okay. Then there's um, rump steak, uh, and it comes with chips. And it comes with a little pack of fat that you cook the chips in with a peppercorn sauce. Quite nice. Um, chocolate hearts. Or there are a, 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 a variety of different things you can choose. It doesn't have to be the hearts. Oh, it okay. could be all stuff. And it comes with a bottle of uh, carver, I think, as well. And that's for 20 quid. Now, that's a roughly a saving of around £17 if you were to buy that all individually. Does Not it taste bad. good? Uh, it's not bad. It's not, <laughs> not bad. bad. No, no, no. No, no. no. I mean, you know, I'm being very honest. Yeah, it's OK. Lovely. It's very good. Okay, like Morrison's. Now, this is a 15 quid dinner for two. Start and main, a side and dessert, and a bottle of wine again. So we've got a prawn cocktail at the start there. Not a lot of prawn cocktail there, but you see, you know, for 15 quid, what do you Do they it? come in a glass? Have we made that a little no, bit sexy? No, they come in a little sachet. Okay, but it's nice yeah. to sort of serve Just it up a little bit. You can put a bit of extra lettuce in there if you wanted. Now, <laughs> yes, you haven't presented that very well, can I say, Philip? Well, the thing not is. Not up to your usual well, standards. No, but the thing is, is you, have to, you have to do it as I say. Oh, okay. So you can't embellish uh, it. You're not allowed to put it in the Otherwise, it's called putting the wool over people's eyes. Let's not do that. Right, the main course is beef wellington. A lot of there, I'm, I'm not good. quite sure about um, how much meat uh, is inside the meat, the, the pastry there, but interestingly enough, no carbohydrates. There's no, no rice or look? pasta or chips. Yeah, yeah have, have a look. See, so this yeah. is, I mean, there's a lot of. Yeah, they get a bottle of Prosecco in there as well. That's a nice big sort of yeah. slab of meat 15 in there. 15 quid. It? And it looks quite impressive, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. Like Wellington. It does. OK, moving on then. And then yes. Asda on the end there. Now, this is quite interesting. This is £10, OK? You get a uh, main course side dessert as well as a bottle of wine. Yeah. Now, I quite like this because it's duck legs. and uh, Duck a l'orange. Classic. Yeah. Yes. Really nice. I quite like the duck leg. OK. You, you know, you can overcook it and it's actually OK. Again, no carbohydrate there, just a bit of root vegetable mash and a salad. You do get a bottle of wine and you get two very small lemon... Um, lemon, what are they? Tarts. Uh, lemon they are. Oh, oh, lemon Sicilian lemon, lemon and passion fruit mousse. Ooh, oh, that mousse. sounds nice. nice. Really why why, why, why are you making small? you think about the carbs? Why does... is that...? Well, generally, if you're balancing a meal, that's what you... you, you always balance a bit of protein, a well. bit of carbs, a bit of vegetables. My husband would definitely say, where's yep. my potatoes? Oh, would he? He would, indeed. My right. potatoes. On that <laughs> note, I'm going to cook you uh, one here. For, this is for ten quid. So we've come up with it. Um, here it is. Um, we've come up with a salmon uh, main course, a bottle of wine and a rhubarb eaten mess, mm -hmm. all for ten quid. That's so, great. So it can okay. be done. Took a bit of working out, but it can be done. Right, first of all, salmon. Here I've got two 100 gram pieces of salmon. This is the point. The point is that the more protein you have, the more expensive it becomes. That's the most expensive part of this dish. Yes. It's protein. <laughs> so, a little bit of salt on there, a little pepper, don't go mad. So don't mess it up. No. And into a, into a nice hot pan. Sorry, not a warm pan, not a hot pan. And this is the secret. What you need to do is just warm that in the pan. You see, it's just bubbling away there. And you put that under a hot grill. Mm -hmm. Under a, a grill. Under grill. In your okay. pan. Like that. Or a hot oven. OK, that's on. So you're grilling. You, you want to cook it for one minute. 100 grams. One, one minute. The hottest you can get it. Right. Take it out, okay. cover it in foil, and then leave it for 10 minutes. And it just when warms. That cooks. Yeah, it cooks perfectly. We'll come salmon on to it doesn't a bit. take much, does it? No, it's not the best way to do salmon in a dishwasher. Oh, sure. <laughs> Good luck with that one. <laughs> no, that's why I have. Have you done no. that on here? No, uh, Did they, you do there it is. They, people have done it. But Thank you. But you need to be very careful. It needs to be wrapped very carefully in full and cling film. And don't put the tablet in. No, and a super clean machine <laughs> as well. In. Right, it does work. It does work. I don't right. fancy it myself, I have to say. So I'll the salmon's resting. <laughs> Here I've got rice noodles. So all you do is pour boiling water on the rice noodles. I like noodles like this. Yep, leave them for eight to ten minutes. And they soften like this one here. Lovely. OK, no cooking. Very simple. Let's get out of the way. Here I've got hot wok. That is hot, isn't it? That's it's yeah. smoking. It's got to be hot. Here we go. Bit, bit of pepper, in that goes. I'm only going to cook one portion here. Obviously, you'll do double the amount. Garlic goes in as well. Really hot. I mean, you're not really cooking it, you're just warming it through. So, you want to keep that crunch. Even after, a, I don't know, 30 seconds, I'll chuck in a little bit of courgette. We allowed one courgette here in the price. Okay, one courgette, yeah. okay. Which you've stripped down very Okay, a mm. little bit of spinach, in that goes as well. And you just, just literally, Wilt that spinach down, OK? And there's some of your supermarket deals there if you fancy cooking. Right, here's the dressing. Valentine's Day. That and smells here, good already, that. Honey, 
And I have soy sauce or tamari if you're gluten free. It's a gluten free mm -hmm. alternative. In that goes. Oh, chili flakes. A little pitch of chili. Mm -hmm. Don't go mad, but they're wickedly hot. Two tablespoons of oil. Oh, that garlic's making me hungry. It Just does. the smell of garlic fried it does. makes you hungry, doesn't it? Two tablespoons of vinegar. And if you really want to make sure it's obviously, if you're going to do gluten free, gluten free, fish sauce. Mm -hmm. So a little bit of that. And that will blow your socks off. Just some drops of that. Just some drops of that. And what you do, what, when this is, this, is, this is nicely wilted, at that point, add the noodles back in. In they go. We'll put them all in, might as well. <laughs> it's fine. And then you add three quarters of the dressing. Right. Just three quarters. Just right. three quarters. You need a quarter to finish it yep. up with. So in that goes, like so. That will give you a lovely bit of steam. And all you're doing is just literally... You have to flick it like that, Phil. It would be quite impressive, you see, if you were coming round now and he was cooking for you, you're in the kitchen going, yeah, yeah just got, take yeah. a seat, darling. Uh, yeah. but normally it goes everywhere. <laughs> yeah, I was just thinking that. It would if I was in trouble. OK, no salt is needed. Good. Because you've got soy sauce. And literally, you spoon this into your bowl. Oh, it's still sizzling. There's a little bit, lovely bit of dressing on there as well. Yeah, it's absolutely gorgeous. OK, now I just want to show you quickly it's very here. colourful, that's it, it is, isn't it? Yeah. Now, this is the salmon that we cooked earlier. Mm-hmm. OK, now I've let it rest, and you will see that it is cooked, but it hasn't fallen apart, Ruth, what we always talk yes. about. And the little white blobs on there, see that? That's the protein that's coagulating. If the protein comes out the top, it's overcooked. I'd have to take that little white blob off well, before you can, I serve it. Well, I'll take it off nice, especially for you, but that's Thank showing you. you that it's not... So it's if it comes out the top, it's overcooked, out the side, you're Absolutely. fine? Absolutely. Yeah. See, I'm Absolutely. listening. Absolutely. On top like that, and then with the, the little bit of bit, dressing... It, Phil. It's the science bit, isn't it, Phil? Oh, Over that goes. No, it's not. Don't worry about that. Good catch.